Good evening, Cyber Friends. It's Mitty Man coming at you from Walks Music. Yet another word for the for the day. This is Saturday night edition, and uh, we want to give God the glory and all the praise and what He deserves every all the honor. We thank you for life and health, health and strength for as well as it is. Also to the whole entire YouTube family, End Time Harvest Game, every one of you. Uh, Mitty Man is cutting through Chase tonight. I just wanted to say a few things. Uh, I've uh, I've been listening and had my ears open and my eyes as well. And I see and hear a lot of talk about, you know, different various people and what God had not told. You know, we got some that say God didn't tell you this and God didn't tell you that. And I don't like to get into that, but I'm going to say one thing. Jesus said that you shall know the tree by the fruit. And um, a lot of people, you know, like I said, they, they, they get down on the TV ministry that we call it. Satellite TV, we, we know that there's uh, a lot of, uh, matter of fact, one of the great networks as far as the uh, Christianity is concerned is the TBN and INSP network. Those are the two greatest ones, I think. INSP being on the East Coast and TBN being based on the West Coast. Nevertheless, um, I only know what people have said. And... Paul Crouch and his wife Jan, they both made their testimonies, and they both have said basically the same thing. Uh, that they, they simultaneously almost heard the word the voice of God tell them the same thing that what He wanted them to do. Now you got the skeptics, and you got all the markers and the you know downgraders that says you know that everybody's involved in wrongdoing, the money and what not. I don't know nothing about all that. But I'm going to say it like this. Paul Krause said God wanted him to do satellite TV and get that gospel all over the world. Well, if you look at his fruit, he's done that to the degree. In other words, it seemed to me that he's doing what God told him. A lot of us talking about what God told us to do, but we haven't done anything yet. So in other words, who, 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 who look more authentic to me <laughs> is the one that's doing the work. Jesus said you know the tree by the fruit. He didn't say you were known by their gifts and their talent. He said you were known by their fruit. So you got a lot of people going around smoking at their mouth, talking about they a part of this and they can't do this and that. They don't never do nothing. So in other words, you ain't doing anything. So that disqualifies you to try to mark or downgrade anybody else that are, you know, that that doing what they at least said their confession. Uh, Paul said that God told him to do to build networks, get the gospel over to, over to the whole entire world. And man, don't you see TBN? I mean, even to David Cirillo and the INSP network, same thing. Those people are busy, and they are doing what they said God had told them to do. So they are showing the fruit. And I don't see none of these other people doing all that running off at the mouth. I don't see them doing anything but that running off at the mouth. People. Jesus said you know the tree by the fruit. He didn't say you know it by the gifts and talents. See, I can get on this keyboard and try to act like I can play everything and you know and sing and do all that. That's all talent and gift. That's no fruit. That's no fruit. Jesus said you know them by their fruit. You can sing your way right on in the hell. Play your way right on in the hell too. So when I look at it, and you know, like I said, I'm not trying to up I'm not trying to, you know, make anybody seem bigger than they are. But I'm just speaking the truth. From what I can see, Jesus told us that we will know the tree by the fruit. So when you start talking about these different people that's going about doing what they said God had told them to do, and you see the fruit, hmm. That's evidence enough to me. So in other words, I don't have to take Paul. If Paul said, Paul Christ said that God told him to take the gospel across the world. Well, I look at Paul's fruit. He had done that with satellite TV all over the world. You got you can find TV in just about everywhere now. That's an indication to me that God must have told him something. Or whatever God told him he's trying to do it. Because he spoke, his confession was that God told him to do this. And you're looking at the fruit when you see TBN come on all over the networks and all over the world. So, hmm, seems like to me, 
He's doing a lot more than us out here that's talking. People that we are not going to support. Don't tear it down. Don't try. Don't if you're not going to support a person, just leave them alone. Don't don't try to tear them up with your mouth and destroy their credibility. Try to demolish their name and stuff like that, because everybody can see them. the people are not crazy. If you are not with me, you're against me. If you're not against me, you're with me. So if that be the case, if you're not going to do anything to help a thing, just leave it alone. Just, just shut your mouth and don't don't go there and try to try to destroy it. Just because you may not understand. There's a lot of things in the world we don't understand. Because we don't know it all. But when you see something that's working. Many men like this here. If I can't help it. I'm not going to try to harm it. And a lot, a lot of times we need to be careful too. Because let me tell you something. You reap what you sow. Every time Buster Brown. You reap what you sow. With that being said. This many man said whatever you get. Whatever you get into. If God is not in it. You better come out of it. This many man saying peace. Good night.